Okay, um, since we've gone over some of the simple crochet stitches, um, we can try to make um, a very simple project. This is a cup cozy, cozy. so it's like a little um, like rectangle for um, a cup. Um, so this is very, very simple to do, um, this kind of a, um, a piece. It's just basically a um, rectangle with um, half double crochet stitches. So we're going to start, and how I like to start this piece is I'm going to start it with, um, I'm using a, let's see, a five millimeter hook. And the kind of yarn I'm using is this, uh, I've got this red heart, and this is the pattern Bright Stripe. Um, this yarn is really awesome because if you look at it, it's got all these crazy colors and they all uh, meld together. And what's cool is if you were making a whole bunch of these, um, all of them would be different because the, the colors keep changing. Okay, so I'm going to start, I'm going to do my slip stitch, okay. And to start this cup cozy, uh, it kind of depends on how... Um, tight or loose your stitches are, um, like your chain stitches. Uh, I'm going to try and keep mine pretty consistent, but I'm going to do um, 27 chain stitches. So one. Okay. Right, that's 27. So if I put this around this circle, um, it's got a little bit of a give to it. Uh, I might go up to 27. I'm going to go 28. I just want to have a little bit more. Okay. Now, um, the trick to starting this off is you want to make sure that your chain um, stays, it doesn't twist. So I'm going to start here and I'm going to really make a point of making sure my chain doesn't twist. Okay. And I'm going to go and I'm going to join my. Um, end of my chain with the beginning of my chain. So let's look at this again. So here are all my stitches. I want those to stay on the outside. It's the outside. So I'm going to grab this tail. I'm going to go through this first stitch and just through the top loop, through the top loop. Okay. And I'm going to do a slip stitch. So that's just, you grab the yarn and you just pull through, pull through. Okay, so what that did is it just linked my um, my beginning chain uh, to my ending. So, so what I was with is back to my beginning. Okay, so uh, we're going to chain up two. One, two. Okay, and like I said, we're going to be doing half double crochet. So this first row, what I like to do is I like to hide this tail inside my stitches. So I'm going to loop around. I'm going through my stitch. And then I'm making sure I go under that thing so I trap it. Okay, and so it's trapped now in that stitch. And then a half double crochet is just you go through all three. Okay, so let's do that again. I'm going to loop over. I'm going through the top loop of my chain, my stitch, and then pull through and go through all three. Okay, so I'm going to go and do um, the rest of this round, um, and then I'll come back. Okay, so I went around. Uh, I currently have 27 stitches. Okay, um, and what I'm going to do is on this last stitch here, um, I'm going to go through here. It's my 28th stitch. Okay, 28. Okay, and now I'm going to slip stitch to the top of the first half double crochet in my row. What I so I'm making a, I'm completing the round. Okay, so a slip stitch. I'm just going to go and pull through. Okay, so that should be 28 stitches. So to go to the next row, I'm going to do one, two, okay? And what I want to do is I'm going to start not in the chain, not in the, the stitch I was just in. I'm going to go to the next one. This is the first one for the next round. So again, I'm going to go through, and I'm going to just do a row of double crochets, or um, half double crochets, okay? So um, that's all this pattern is, just half double crochets, and you um, keep going until you get the height that you want, usually about eight rows. Um, should be good uh, if you want a really really um, big cozy then you go to like 10 rows but um, all this pattern is is just um, half double crochets and it goes very very quick and I think I'm actually gonna get to a color change in a second for my yarn which is gonna be kind of cool
Okay, so now you can see my yarn is changing color just right along. And I really like this yarn because it's like a neon. It's really kind of funky. Um, and like I said, if you were making it for a bunch of people, like a bunch of cozies for a bunch of people, then you can just keep going and they'll all be different. Okay, so I'm almost to this last stitch of my round. I'm going to go do my half double crochet. And then again, I'm going to go and I'm going to sneak into that top one and slip stitch. And now I'm ready my next row. I'm going to go one, two, and that's the pattern. You're just going to keep going one, two, and do a round, slip stitch together. One, two, do a round, slip stitch together. And then eventually you're going to have something like this. Okay, so this brings, this is the bottom. Our chain is kind of the bottom here. And I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven rows. Okay, and that gives you a pretty nice, um, a nice size. Um, other yarn, so this one was a little shorter. Okay. This is a yarn um, that's neon and it's more um, speckly. It's more intermittent. So like the pattern when it comes up is a little uh, a little more neat. Um, this one um, is more, um, uh, has some tinsel going through it. So it's like a solid piece. Um, and really this is like kind of a nice beginner project just because of the fact that uh, it works up pretty fast, probably about a half an hour if you're not, if you're not super, super fast. Um, and then you have like a nice um, uh, end product and uh, this is a really nice thing to give as uh, if you want to make a gift for a bunch of people you know if you get a, um, a, a skein of yarn like I said that changes colors then you can just keep on going and then they'll all be different so I think that this um, this yarn um, that I had was was from here so like uh, I started here and then it went to this and now this is is the top here so just I keep going and then it, they're all the cup cozies are gonna be different colors because of the change in the yarn so um, that's it so that's how you make a cup of cozy so again you go um, chain up two and then it's just half double crochets going all the way around um, and then you're just going to um, take a um, a needle and then you can kind of hide your um, tails um, from the top and the bottom and uh, that's it